Nothing can stop me, I'm all the way up to get with another video you are with life with Kara where we do reactions reviews but today it's a little bit different I got something a little bit extra up the sleeve now if you don't know I just did a recent video on a pair of DS gate shoes if you don't if you want to go see that video link will be in the descriptions so go check that video out but I see I see a lot of people like when I do DS Gate videos. And I know the whole purpose of y'all coming on YouTube and like coming on YouTube to search DS Gate is y'all probably want to order from DS Gate. But most of you guys are a little scared to step outside your comfort zone and order because don't nobody want to lose no money. Don't nobody want to get scammed. Last thing anybody want to do is get scammed. So I took the time out myself today to show y'all guys how to order stuff off DS Gate. Without getting scammed, I'm gonna tell you things you should look for. Things you like, things just just a no go. If you see these, they are red flags. And for that, can you guys like the video and drop a sub? Cause we on the way to 500 and we almost there. So first off, we gonna start off. I screen recorded my phone, so I'm gonna basically talk through the screen recording. Break down things, then at the end, I'm gonna come back and do a recap. Make sure y'all got like grasp of everything I said. But let's go ahead and get to this. I ain't gonna waste no more time. Y'all go ahead and like that video and hit that sub button. Dang. All right, you guys. So, first thing you want to do is get the DH Gate app on Google or Apple Play Store. Now, get DH Gate sell a variety of things such as shoes, clothing. Whole bunch of wide selections, but mostly people are there for their shoes. There's the home screen, it shows all the categories, different things. You might use that sets, but we getting straight into the shoes. So first, I look through the shoes and accessories, see what type of shoes you like. You know, everybody don't have to necessarily like Jordans and all them things of that nature. But they sell a variety of things, sports, outdoor activities, electronics, headphones. They pretty much sell almost everything, guys. I can't make it up. But let's go ahead and get into these shoes, my boy. Alright, I type very slow, so don't talk about me too bad. Jordan 1s. Alright. So, as you see, to be honest with you guys, the higher the price is, the better. Now, you see how this order has 236 orders? That's really not a, like, good number. It's an okay number. But you always want to look at the reviews and pictures. The views and pictures will really make or sell you on an item, to be honest with you. Give y'all time a minute to read what Buddy said, but he said a lot. You can pause it for that. Them shoes look kind of beat up to me, so I don't get, like, they didn't look too great to me, but a Buddy who got the shoes named them a five, like five, five out of five. So, like, you just got to be, everybody got different expectations. Now, these look a little bit more better than the last ones. Remember, all stock X, I mean, all DH Gate shoes come to stock X symbol. So don't think because you got the symbol, it's actually, it might be real. That's just, you know, that's, that's just how they work. You know what I'm saying? They put a lot of effort into it. But this is what a bad person said about it. He said he never got his order after like four months. And to let you guys know, DH Gate does take a long time. They do give you an option where you can um, get your shipment faster. But you pay a lot of extra money. And it's like how much money you pay, you might as well get the real shoe in my eyes. So this one was not a good one at all. Tell you some other things to look out for. 61 orders. No, 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 no. Please don't ever order from anybody that got 61 orders. But he didn't even but he didn't even have no reviews. Did he have some reviews? He had reviews, but he had more reviews than he did items sold. And look at the first shoe. Look at this. That person said that's a good shoe. Can y'all tell? What is that? What is that? L like I said, you guys, when I get shoes off this gate, you got to take your time. You got to literally take your time. I'll be on there for an hour or two making sure I'm getting the best sh seller, highest seller shoe, best reviews. It's just something. It's one of these things where you really, you can't like, you can't just try to be quick and fast about it. You really got to sit down and take your time with it. 
Here we go another one. 104 orders. It was I don't even think he had pictures for this one. And you see it's only 42 5 out of 5 reviews. It's 104 items sold. So pay attention to that also. This is another 200 order. Yeah, I, I, when I was looking through it, I didn't want to keep going through a whole bunch of 200 orders. Because some people order from them. But me personally, I have never ran into a problem with this gate. So the best thing to look for is high orders. Anything in hundreds is bad. I'm going to be honest with you. Anything in hundreds in my eyes is bad. Some people try to risk, but I'm not a risk taker like that. So as you see, I'm fumbling through the app. Every time I get on the app, I have to literally fumble and get to the right seller, right shoe. That's one thing I don't like about the app. Like, wherever you go to last time, it's not the same. So I went to sort. I will always hit high and low. Always hit high and low, you guys. I'm telling you, the more you pay for the shoe, the better the quality. You should be paying from around 60 to $80 for your shoes off Dayscape. And that, not just 10, if you're paying 60 to $80, you're probably getting the best quality. And sometimes not even says it's probably right at that fifty range, you know. But with shipment and all that stuff, that the reason why I say sixty eight dollars is because when shipment and all this stuff comes around. Now this order day is a little bit better. It's nine hundred and fifteen sold items. It's rated a four point nine. Here go a couple of reviews. Hey man, you gotta watch out for some of these pictures because you know some of these pictures be looking kind of sketchy. You never know. They got them red um Thunder Four, not red Thunder Fours. My bad, you guys. Them Fours, yellow Fours. I forgot the name on it was. They looked it pretty decent off the pictures that were shown. But like I said, you really, it's really about taking your time, looking through, making sure you are getting something that you are a hundred percent sure about. You don't ever want to get purchase a shoe and you like you unsure about it. Two hundred thirty six. Like I said. I don't even I don't even bother to look at those. Now sometimes them two hundred thirty six have some good shoes. Some shoes like like if you go through and look through the bottom of it, some of them be having good shoes. But no, you are taking a risk. Like I said, this gate you want it to be no risk. You're already getting a replica, so you don't want to you don't want to get a replica that's a bad replica, and you didn't got scanned out of money. And it took several to 8, 10, 20 months to get here. It already takes a month to get here already. You don't want to wait longer than that. They give you an option to pay for more stuff. But, like, don't nobody want to pay an extra $50 just for no freaking shoes to come in three days. I was here. I'm showing you the different ways how you talk to the sellers. Like, when you order stuff, they basically give you order confirmation. Sometimes the sellers send you deals and things of that nature. Phone acting a little slow. Yeah, but that's basically pretty much the the get go with all that. I think this point of the video when I go to like some real shoes, like I show y'all the shoes that you do need to invest in. Shoes you do need to put like by right here. Eight thousand orders. This is the place you want to order from. You need ones. Come to this person right here. Eight thousand orders. He have over twelve thousand reviews, you guys, and he's rated like four star. Yeah, four point five stars. Look at the reviews. Like, so these are the people you need to order from. Don't order from nobody else. Every person you order from needs to be in the thousands. I bet y'all like why he is screaming. We understand. He it needs to be in the thousands, you guys. I don't think. Like, it needs to be in a thousand. If you want to take no risks, all that. Another thing I like about these guys, sometimes you have to select the box to come with the shoe. Like, sometimes you have to text the seller and be ask them. Because, like, sometimes it be, like, box sold without shoe. And sometimes it be, like, you got to buy the box. But the box be, like, sometimes the seller will mark the box for free or it be, like, 83 cents. And you got to pay for that, like, with the shoe sometimes. So, you got to watch out for that. So, pay attention to when you try to order shoes, it say, like, box sold separate and stuff like that. Another one, 3,000-something orders, you guys. 2,000 reviews. That means almost, that's, like, 85% of the people that ordered from him left the review. They gave pictures. They showed the shoe look like. Now, these shoes looked a little bit ashy to me, but, you know, you know what I'm saying? They don't look that bad with certain pictures and certain angles. The shoes was kind of ashy in real life if you got them. So, you know. That's how things work, you know? So, like like I said, find people that put pictures, 
good reviews and over a thousand sales. It Yup, if you made it this far in the video, you might as well go ahead and hit that sub button and go ahead and hit that like button while you're still here. Now, as the screen recording I just saw, now, I bet like, I could have told you. I could have told you them things right here looking face face camera, but I really just want to give y'all a demonstration and show y'all how to, like, maneuver, work around the app. You really got you really got to sit there and play with it. But like I said, or don't. Only order from people that have at least a thousand reviews. If they and listen, this is an important key. If they got a thousand sold shoes, they need to have at least four to five hundred reviews. If they got a thousand shoes sold but three reviews, no, don't don't order from them guys. Probably a scam. You know how you know the people be ticking, they be they be hacking, they be hacking on us, man. They be hacking. They be trying to take out working hard money. And I'm trying to put this I'm trying to put this message out for you guys so don't nobody take your working hard money. Cause I know money don't come easy. You know what I'm saying? Money don't grow on trees. I wish it did. I'll be out here picking trees right now. You feel me? But like I said, make sure they have a they gotta have for me, you gotta have at least fifteen hundred item sold just in my eyes but you can you can shoot for a thousand depending on what you buy like i said they don't just sell shoes they sell a lot of different varieties of things so shoes is, to me in my eyes is their most popular thing but like i said make sure over a thousand sales reviews pictures and make sure they have at least they don't gotta have half but they need to have at least for Every like for every soul shoe, they need to have at least like five. So let's say they got eight hundred soul shoes, you know, really don't need to be buying that. But they need to at least have three to four hundred reviews, and it need to at least be six pictures of six different things. If you if you is gonna take that risk or order, cause like I said, sometimes some people that have fifty three orders have shoes that the other people that have eight thousand don't. Sometimes people that be having 8,000 orders sold, like items sold, it be the same. Like, they don't have a wide variety of different shoes. So, like, it, it, keep, it do keep you limited on certain things and certain items. But, that's pretty much the gist of it. Like I said, take your time. Don't be trying to sit there. Oh, I'm in Walmart. Let me, let me, let me get some of this yet. No, sit down when you ain't got nothing to do. Look through the app. Play around. And pick what's best for you in your eyes. Like I said, you should be paying up the like you should be really paying like fifty to sixty, maybe like that seven that seventy eighty like means you put you getting real top quality. Like I said, they do give you an option for faster shipment, but after you see that price, you be like, boy, I might as well get the real ones, dog. Ain't even no point. Ain't even no point of getting it out dead gate. I'm finna pay one thirty. I'm finna go get the real shoes and be huh, huh, flex. I don't even gotta walk fast. Now I'm just playing. They shoes be of good quality. Like I said, if you want to see one of my um Dish Gate shoe reviews, the link will be in the description to the last video. But that's pretty much all I got for you guys today. Like I said, Life with Kari. I showed y'all a how to video today, pretty much basically. But I do do reaction and reviews. And if you like things of that nature, please feel free to hit that sub button. Nobody's stopping you. I don't even know. I don't even get a notification all the time when people sell. So I won't even know. Just go ahead and hit this sub button. Go ahead and like the video. Thank you. I hope you have a wonderful day. Um, I got encouraging words. Well, what I, what I can tell y'all. Excuses only sound good to the people that is making them. So you're making an excuse not to hit that sub button. It only sounds good to you. Not to me.